What is good everybody? Your friendly neighborhood gamer Zago coming back with you again for another South Park Phone Destroyer related video. Gonna be doing some more card pack opening. We finish this weekend's event. It is currently 5.30 a.m. in the morning and I'm about to go to work and carry the waifu to go to work. You can see her there in the bathroom getting ready. But yeah, I figured I'd try and knock this out for you guys so that you can have this to watch on the channel. So without further ado, this weekend's event, a summoning ritual, revolves around the reset and release Satan card. We still haven't gotten a copy as yet, so that kind of sucks for us. So fingers crossed we can pull and pull a copy. Uh, this was the deck that we used. It was a card point based event. We ran a five point deck. I feel like we did relatively okay. We got the event done, I think, last night. Uh, let's open these packs and hope for a Satan. Pack numero uno. All in all, fresh new start to the season. First week, more or less, of the new season. We've been playing a freeze oriented deck, which has kind of been fun. taking some L's here and there but we've managed to do relatively okay so we're getting cash and Cartman coins from this event which is not bad I uh, need about 4,500 Cartman coins to level up my energy staff because I've been messing around with that trying it out in my decks and stuff so 4,500 coins that we can get energy staff to I think level 5 I'll have to double check that, but yeah, in the meantime, just stockpiling most of our mats. Don't really have anything outright to upgrade right now that's not sci-fi related. So we're, we're pretty much hella low on sci-fi mats all in all. We were working on Porphys Doggy for a while, got him to 5, started leveling up Ice Sniper Wendy so we could run the Freeze deck. So finally got her to max level 4, we just need enough copies now to level her up all the way. After we had leveled her to 5, so now we can get her to max level 5. That's the aim. So this event also had the old outfit for the Satan, the last Satan event because this is a repeat event. So we already got that so I don't think we get any outfit from this pack. I heard some people complaining about that considering but I mean fair is fair if you already have it you already have it Officer Barbary they want to get him up to level 5 eventually but we're stockpiling neutral mats mostly for Santa Claus in case we actually get enough copies because that card is hella fun to play with without a doubt I've been seeing a couple of level 4s run, run, running around with all the Card pack offers that Red Links has been putting out. A lot of people seem to be taking advantage of those. Saw a level 14 new kid with a level 3 miss um, with a level 3 Satan. And saw a level 60 new kid with a level 4 Santa Claus. And I'm just like, man, I wish I was those guys. See principal. Like I was saying before in a couple of events, at this point in the game's life cycle, there's not really much that I need for my collection per se. Mostly just having mats and Cartman coins to level up stuff to try out here and there. And more or less get everything at a level that can be played in challenge mode or friendly battles. More rare than a common, right? Rare, that's it. Just a rare. He's stacking you, kid. Rare card, kid. Terrence and Philip copies are always a good thing to donate to the clan. Need to level up Mr. Mackey and Witch Doctor, um, Witch Garrison. But we'll get to that eventually because I don't really use those cards. But they're pretty good from what I've heard in challenge mode from Tencent. Alright, so final solo pack chance for a new card. This might be a copy of Satan, fingers crossed. I'll even take some copies of Santa Claus at this point. But really looking forward to a copy of Mr. Satan because it's the only card that we don't have. Alright, cash, coins, neutral mats for the win. 
I don't think I've seen us get any copies of Marcus. That's also another thing that uh, okay, you're we're about enough. halfway to a level five Marcus. So looking forward to that as That's well. That's good. Now open some more. You're an asshole. Oh, they kind of hope that was Marcus, but principal. And of course, with our shit luck, no Satan card. But we got a copy of Tully. I guess that counts for something. Alright, and let's blow through these team packs as well. Most of the time, the rare chance that I do actually get something that I, I need or want is pretty slim but most of the times when i do these videos it's kind of just to talk with you guys express my views on some of the stuff going on in the game get you guys feedback and input on like what you might want to see or whatever Whoa, marvin nice marvin man. all right last four packs but yeah all in all hope you guys enjoyed the event hope you guys enjoyed your weekend Card point events are a welcome break from PvP. I mean, from token collection events. Because those usually rip into your in game cash pretty hard. Like bears, don't you? So, the good news for this is we're already at 8,000 Cartman coins, so we'll have enough to upgrade energy stuff and probably upgrade one or two levels on some other stuff. Need to start conserving and stockpiling on our in-game appearances. Rare, 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 rare. All the neutral things. We're a little bit near to. We're about three quarters of the way on on Mimsy to get him to level six. But that's something, right? You can try out some Mimsy shenanigans, even though common cards aren't all that great anymore. But I'm happy that. This is what I'm happiest for is the fact that we're getting neutral mats because I was pre I was running I was starting to run kind of low on those. Marcus. There we go. See, if I had at least gotten more of these, it would have been definitely worthwhile. But we can rock with this for the time being. We're 55 out of 100, so we got 45 more copies of Marcus to go. Rare is good. And the final team pack. Out of the entire thing, we got like one Marcus basically. Almost had 500 in game cash, so that's nice. Can't have too many rares. Now I just need to have some self control and not spend it. Alright, we got Dalpu. Hey! I mean, it's no legendary. That's yet. what I'm talking about. Alright, so we got two copies of Marcus there, so that's good. Whoa, nice rare. Gimsy, 700 rare, rare, rare. out of 1000. Well, and boom more red swarms all right so pretty much as expected no satan card copy for us but it is what it is completed the event and we didn't fall too far in our ranking we're at 1390 i should probably switch over to that freeze deck that i was telling you guys about that we don't go into a match with the event deck that we're using instead all right, so like I was saying, kind of this is the deck I'm running. Kind of running a freeze deck. Paul Fist Dougie freezes stuff. Program Stand freezes stuff. Freezer freezes stuff. Osimo freezes stuff. Ice Sniper Wendy also freezes stuff. That's pretty much all the freeze cards that are in the game for the most part. Uh, it's been working out relatively okay so far. Six Element Randy recently got buffed after the season reset because vacuums move slower now. So we were we've been trying out that a bit. Bounty Hunter Carl. This card is just like OP broken in general. So, been having fun with that. But yeah, all in all, that's Salt Park Phone Destroyer for you. So, with that being said, my ass needs to get to work and drive the waifu so that she can get to work as well. So, this is where I'll bid you guys adieu for now. And as always, until next time, keep on gaming. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, like all our videos.
do go check us out on Facebook. You can search us under the name Zalgo Comet. Follow us on Twitter at Mr. Underscore Gamehead. And as always, keep on gaming. Visit our game review blog at www.zalgocomet.blogspot.com. See you guys later.